Hey folks, the same night that the Georgia Guidestones were attacked, I guess, the obelisk inside of the square at the Vatican was struck by lightning, supposedly. And now Rome and the Vatican is on fire, and it doesn't seem like anybody's talking about this. Not on the mainstream media. Maybe a little bit out of, uh, like, Israel I've seen, but as far as, like, American YouTube and all that, I can barely find anything on it. You would think that this would be running and, and viral. Yeah, the Vatican is on fire, burning down, burning down Rome. Nobody's reporting on it. Here, check this out. Here. Let me uh, go back here. Check this out. Go to history. Rome is burning. Yeah. They're hearing explosions. Then all of a sudden there's this huge fire. This guy was fortunate enough to to film it for us. Wow, the sky has a... What's in the sky right there? What is that? What is that way up there? Huh. So here, check this out. Gender shit. Can't believe this country. Um... James Kaufman, World News Report today. Today is July 10th, 2022, 5 p.m. Central here in the U.S. James Coffin's great. Years, no matter where you are in the world, folks. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. Ladies and gentlemen, a lot of you don't know, the same day that Georgia Guidestones were struck by lightning, the historic obelisk in the Vatican obelisk. City was struck by lightning on the same afternoon, July 7th, 2022. Pieces of bricks and mortar were scattered near the site. Now, folks, the Vatican is on fire. Mm -hmm. It's the 10th. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this was posted Same footage. today. The Vatican has caught fire and it is burning. They said that a massive explosion was heard and a fire in Rome overtook the Vatican Black smoke expanded it's crazy. in the city center, uh, and there was going to be a rock concert scheduled for tonight. Yeah, That's, yeah. Of course, been your canceled. rock concerts canceled it's like a really forever. Strong fire. I wonder if all of Rome. The Vatican's only like one square mile, but underneath it is these these huge tunnels. There's something like, I think it's 55 miles of tunnels that have nothing but our history books inside of it. Nothing but pure history. You know, when Jesus, I'm sorry, uh, Julius Caesar went and took over the library uh, of Alexandria, the only area that, I know history is going to lie to you, but the only area that, that actually was uh, burnt in that fire was the census. They don't want us to know the bloodline. They don't want us to know what's really going on on this earth. And all that other information was salvaged and brought under these tunnels in the Roman uh, Vatican. It's funny because I've been hearing that not only will Trump be the last president, but this, this Jesuit pope, the only Jesuit pope, will be the last pope. So, yeah. Better get on your big boy boots because something's really going down with all these governments collapsing and all of the infrastructure collapsing and uh, destroying our, our earth, destroying our, our water sources, mead and pal, all are, are emptying. Uh, Hoover Dam is, is damn near empty. Um, they're exploding food processing centers and there's been four gas 
processing plants that have exploded since June 8th. Yeah, the shit is hitting the fan. So, I still don't understand how people are just still just ignorant to what's going on. All right, take care, folks. God bless. The Vatican and Rome are burning. Burn, baby, burn. <laughs> Thanks. God bless and leave a message. Leave a comment if you would like. Take care.